Hi guys, welcome back to another very exciting video tutorial. In this video tutorial, you're going to learn at how you can implement some drawing into your application. So by the end of this video tutorial, you will be able to make this simple drawing app. You simply drag your finger across the screen and lines just start to appear. It's really simple, really minimal. And I may make a part 2 of this video tutorial teaching you how to reset this drawing as well as to implement other colors. Without further ado, let's get right into making this application. I'm going to quit the simulator and just close this as well. Delete the drawing app because we are going to start fresh. I'm going to open up Xcode, create a new Xcode project. Sync of your application is fine and I call this drawing app. So I'm going to head into my main storyboard and I'm going to drag an image view into the view controller. I'm going to expand the image view such that it fills the view controller as well as change this to iPhone 6s. Now click on the assistant editor which is two circles overlapping each other and click on the image view and drag this into your code and I'm going to call this image view and that's all for the main storyboard we're going to head in back to the view controller and start writing some code okay so what we're going to do now is to create two new variables so we need the last point and we need a swiped boolean value which would be especially important in determining whether the user has swiped or not now I'm going to type in the uh, touches began function. I want to say if let touch equals touches stop first, meaning we're going to get the first touch if there is. Then I'm going to set the last points, which we have over here, and I'm going to set it to the touch dot location in view, and in which view, the self dot view. That's all for the touches begin. And next we're going to for the touches moved. And for the touches move, I, I'm actually going to create a new function which will implement the drawing. So func draw lines from point, which would be of type CG point, and to point, which will also be of type CG point. So first, we want to add UI graphics, begin image context, and the size would be self dot view dot frame dot size. This will be the size of it. Next, we want to set the image view dot image dot draw. I want to draw in CG rec. I want to choose the one with the CG float, 0, 0, width will be self, dot view, dot frame, dot width. This will be self, dot view, dot frame, dot height. Then we want to uh, create a new variable called context and set it to the UI graphics, get current context. Now we want to start moving the context around. So context dot move move and this one's a parameter of a C I mean one an argument of a CG point. So CG point from point which is a reference to this variable over here dot x and this will be from point dot y. Then we're going to add add line to CG point and if we two point which is a reference to this variable to this local variable dot x two point dot y. Now we're going to customize the context so context dot set blend mode 
set it to cgblendmode.normal you can call it whatever you like but I'm just going to set it to normal context.setLineCap cglinecap.round context.set line width will be let's just set it to 5 and context.set maybe stroke color set stroke color we want the one with the color of type CG color and this will be like UI color and red would be 0 0 0 because we want it to be entirely black now we want to actually start the stroke so stroke path then now that after after we have implemented the drawing and stuff like that what we want is we want the image view dot image equals the UI graphics UI graphics get image from current image context then we want UI graphics and the image context because by now the drawing would have ended okay so now that we have done uh, implementing the drawing lines what we can do is to in our touches not move we'll say if let touch equals to touches dot first then we want to draw lines from the point would be the last point and to point let's just create a new variable for var current point equals to the touch dot location in self dot view okay so now that we have draw, drawn the line we want to update the last point so I'm going to set the last point equal to the current point last but not least we want to implement the touches ended so over here what I want to do is if swiped which mean we just means that if uh, swipe is equal to false then we want to draw lines from point last point two point last point as simple as that um i also forgot to just set this to swipe equals true because uh, in the touches move the user will have swipe the screen and the touches begin i want to set swipe equal to false okay so now we have two errors over here let's resolve them cannot evoke of type ui color oops we need to convert the ui color to of type cg color by doing dot cg color Okay, let's see the second arrow. Expected this in expression list. Ooh, that's an error. Let's, let me just try changing this to let and change let as well. And let's try running it. It failed because it expected this. Oops. Ah, there you have it. Okay, so now what we're going to do is to run the application and try. Okay, three, two, one. Here goes nothing. All right, there we have it. So now we have implemented some simple uh, drawing functionality into our app. Okay, this is really minimal, nothing too oppressive, but maybe maybe in this part two of this video tutorial, I'm gonna teach you at how you can reset this drawing, and you can also change the colors of this uh, lines. Okay, so congratulations for making it to the end of this video tutorial and to this band, peace out. Bye.